Hello. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to check your flight status with Potter Airlines. Here's a step-by-step -step guide on how to check your flight status with Potter Airlines. The first thing to do is to open your web browser and go to www.flypotter.com. Then on the home page, which we have in here, scroll down to find the flight status section, okay, which we have in here. So you have book a flight, put a pass, check in flight status and my bookings. Now click on flight status to open the search page which we have in here. Now you have two options to check your flight status. Number one, like flight number, that's enter the specific flight number for the Potter Airlines flight you wanna check. And the next thing is the flight date. So enter the, the patcher, um, sorry, flight number. I'm sorry about the flight number stuff. So by flight number, enter the specific flight number and the specific date. And then the next thing is by route. So by route or by route, depending on how you pronounce it, you're going to have to enter the departure the city, arrival city, and of course the flight date. So once you use any of these options, go ahead and select, go ahead and fill out all of the boxes that are necessary. And the next thing that you need to do is to click on check status button, which is just right next to, which is just at the right corner of the flights that you want to search for now once you do that once you click on check status the current status of the flight on time delayed cancelled etc will be displayed along with additional details such as the departure and arrival times now go ahead and keep checking this page closer to your departure time for the most up-to-date information about your flight and if your flight is delayed or cancelled the status will reflect these changes and potter airlines may provide further instructions and that's it you have now successfully checked the status of your potter airlines flight now go over to the tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps and of course once you are done you'll be good to go i hope this tutorial marvelously helped you search